Okay, so to add integers, this is way one. Create a T chart. One side has positives, the other side has negatives. So if I have the problem, negative 10 plus, that's a 10, plus positive 6, I would put the negatives on the negative side and the positives on the positive side, like this. I have 10 negatives, so I'm going to make 10 negatives. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Then you do the same for the positive side. How many positives do you have? You have six. So you're going to make six positives. A positive and a negative cancel each other out. So you cancel out the pairs. So you've got one pair, two pairs, three pairs, four pairs, five pairs, six pairs. Once you have them canceled out, you have to figure out what's left. What's left is in my bubble cloud. I have one, two, three, four negatives. So the answer is negative four. There's another way to do this. This is the first way I'm showing you. And it works well in the beginning to check your work because you'll use the second way to solve the problem and then you can always use this way way one with a t-chart to check your work. Okay, way number two. You're going to subtract the numbers. Even though it says add. So you're going to put the big number on top, then subtract. Okay, here's your example. Negative 27 plus positive 8. So you're going to put the bigger number on top. And you're going to put the smaller number on the bottom. Then you're going to subtract. 17 take away 8 is 9. Bring down your 1. So the answer is 19. But you need to keep in mind 
You must. Take this sign of the bigger number. So let's remember our problem. It was minus 27 plus 8. Which one is the bigger number, 27 or 8? 27 is bigger than 8. So you use the sign of the bigger number. So your answer is negative 19. So the way you check it, Make a T-chart. You're going to have a lot of minuses. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Cancel them out. 1, 2, 3... Four, five, six, seven, eight. How many do you have left? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. We'll have to go back. And that was kind of a hard one to check this way because it's such a large number. But you see my point. To check it, 19. when you go back, you should have 19 negatives. If you didn't, like this one, I probably want to take my time and make a bigger t-chart, make it really accurate so I can see. With the stylus, it's a little difficult, it's chunky, difficult to write. But this is the way you can check it, or you could do it this way and check it the other way. But you have two ways to solve adding integer problems.